My name is Erica Colon and I'm a long-term case manager. We recommend self-directed program at all times when we enroll in new members or when we visit with them on a quarterly basis. And it's mainly focused on members who want to remain in the community, meaning the home setting, and members who have sometimes very complex cases that requires a lot of care that sometimes we cannot utilize agencies because they have some limitations in certain things that they need to do for the member. So those are the situations we recommended. I learned about self-directed care when um, myself and my family, uh, we were taking care of my grandmother. And she was supposed to be more like a nursing home setting, but we made an executive decision to keep her at home. And that's where I learned about it, where I allowed my mother and myself and my sister to take care of my grandmother for the next 10 years until she passed away. It was very important to have our grandmother at home because culturally, where I come from, I'm from Colombia, so we take care of our elders. We take that very dearly and we feel that as now the, we're the caretakers of someone who took care of us at one point of our lives. So it was very important for us to do that. Uh, for instance, the case that I used to have that the daughter was a pharmacist. Uh, she was from India and it was very important for her that the caregivers she utilized were from the same background where she came because she wanted people to read to her mom and she wanted people to speak the same language that her mom would understand. The role that I have played for public partnership, it has been um, helping people to become aware of how this program could benefit them and giving them the independence they need to a certain level to make decisions for their own care. And it has also helped me to bring ease into their lives where they feel that they can utilize their own caregivers who they trust that will do the best for their care. Public partnership makes my life easier, just the fact that they're in charge of the enrollment, they're in charge of the payroll, uh, they're in charge of the um, background checks that our caregivers are required to take in order to take care of our members. So, and the fact that they're able to, the members are able to execute the duties that the caregiver needs to do, so that has made my job easier. When the families get into self-directed care, a uh, sense of relief. They feel very relief, they feel very happy. Uh, I think one of the things that affects a lot of families when their loved ones are sick is that they lose control of their life. They feel like they're losing control of their lives. And the self-directed gives them some power, some control to them that they still are able to make their own decisions. And I think that's something we forget because uh, one of the things that our members struggle with is losing their independence.